You don't own your woman. When they tell you, you gonna put a ring on my finger, that shuts you right up. You say, okay, because you don't. I know you spend a lot of your money on your woman, and I know you go to the movies, and you go to get the ice cream and the candy and the flowers and the anklets and the bracelets and help her get some clothes, and you're spending all your money on shit you would never spend it on, but you don't own her. Just theoretically, that pussy's on lease. <laughs> you're leasing the pussy with an option to buy. But be careful, because you lose half on the trade-in. You got to be careful. You got to have a J-O-B in the 80s. You got to have some money. You got to have some money. You can't get no pussy. Listen to the radio. That's what it's about. Listen to Madonna. I'm a material girl in a material world. You ain't got no money. You can't have no pussy. <laughs> Basically what it is, there's a song out now called Got to Have a J-O-B if you want to be with me. And the lyrics go, ain't nothing going on but the rent. Like, if you went up and said, hey, babe, what's going on? The rent, motherfucker. <laughs> Do you have a job? Well, I, 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 I want to get the fuck out of my face. <laughs> got to have some money. It says, no romance without finance. And women love them songs. They be going, got to have a day. <laughs> Janet Jackson got a hit record, what have you done for me lately? That's what they be thinking. What have you done for me lately? The record start off like that. I know he used to do shit for you, but what has he done for you lately? <laughs> Baby, I love you. What have you done for me lately? <laughs> you the only thing on my mind. What have you done for me lately? <laughs> we make good love. What have you done for me lately? <laughs> Got to have some money to get some pussy in the 80s. It's fucked up. That's why I say, hey, I'm a target. I, if I ever get married, I have to go off to the woods of Africa and find me some crazy, naked zebra bitch <laughs> that knows nothing about money. She got to be butt naked on a zebra with a big bone in her nose and a big plate lip and a big fucked up afro. An afro, afro got to, like Angela Davis scene and go, God damn, that's some fucked up shit. Afro gotta be fucked up and one of them picks with a fist in the back and, her, she, and she gotta be butt naked because if she got some clothes, she gonna pocket, she gonna have to put something in the pocket. So she gotta be butt naked on the zebra and y'all think it's a joke, y'all gonna go, I'ma walk up and say, hey, how you doing? Money? She go, I will, I will, I will. I say, Miss Murphy, Miss Murphy. And I'ma bring her home, y'all think it's a joke, y'all gonna go past a newsstand one day and see me on the cover of Jet with some woman with a big bone and a plate and a big fucked up afro, butt naked, and y'all gonna say, hey, Eddie must be visiting Africa. I'll say, Murphy marries Bush bitch. I'ma be like... What? What? Cause I ain't getting caught. I refuse to get caught out there, I fuck that. And I'ma bring her home and lock her up in the house. You go off to Africa and get you a bushwoman, you can't let her mingle with American women because they'll change her shit up. American women stick together. Last thing they want to see is you got some trained bush bitch in your house. They will catch her by herself in the kitchen and throw a monkey wrench in your whole program. As soon as they get alone, they'll be like, I can't stand it. You be running behind him doing everything he tell you to do. Who you think he is? You, you ain't no guard. You a human being. You ain't supposed to treat nobody. This house is too big for one person to be cleaned up. Why don't you leave? You, you always crying. Why don't you just leave the nigga? Oh, you know something, girl. Do you know you can take half his money? Did you know you can take half his money? Did you know that? Did you know you entitled? You, he didn't tell you entitled to half? Oh, he only told you half the story then, girl. You can take half the money, the car, the house, the children, all the money he got. You can buy all the zebras and bones you want. Go back home and style, girl. You don't have to put up with this shit and get your hair done right. Cut that big afro shit off and go back home to Africa and style. Who the hell do you think he is? Let me tell you something else about Eddie Murphy. That motherfucker ain't nothing but a butt. Oh, hi, Eddie. How you doing? Oh, I didn't know you was here. You scared me. Ooh, I don't know. I, I can't stay. I was just talking to Um Fufu about a couple of things, uh huh? No, 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 I got to go. I got to go. You two, y'all two lovebirds talk. Eddie, talk to your woman. Talk to Um Fufu. Y'all got a lot to talk about. Go on. Go on, Eddie, please. Talk to her. Um Fufu. And leave me in the kitchen with some bush bitch with an attitude. Eddie. Eddie. I want to talk to you. What's your problem, baby? I don't like the way you treat me, Eddie. You treat me like animal. 
You was butt naked on a zebra last month. I don't care, Eddie. I'm an American woman now. I want what's coming to me. Eddie, what have you done for me lately? I want you to be happy with what you want. Half! Give me half, Eddie. Give me half, Mr. Fuck You Man. Suck my dick, Eddie. You motherfucker. Then I'd be on the front page of the African Inquirer like this. This is what is going on inside your house every night. Baby, come on now. Come on, please, please. You go, no, stop it, stop it. I said, stop, stop. Said, baby, come on, please. Now, come on, stop. We just stop. Oh, stop. That's simple. Can we please stop? Are we going to go too far? I want it to go too far. Come on now, baby. Stop. Oh, come on. Oh, we can stop. I just don't think the time is right. Well, my dick don't get much harder than this.